Hey guys! Summer 646 is going to be a bridesmaid in one of her friend's wedding and her dress is pink and gold. And so this is the look that I came up with. And um, especially some, you know, for wedding or for dances, it's always a good idea to wear a base. That way you're not worried about is your eyeshadow fading? Is it creasing? What's going on? You know, you have to look at, in the mirror every couple of seconds. So I'm using um, soft ochre paint pot, paint pot by MAC, but you don't have to use this. You can use Urban Decay, you can use Too Faced Shadow Insurance, L'Oreal. I've been hearing a lot of good things about their um, eyeshadow base called L'Oreal Decrease. I don't know if my camera's picking that up, it's thunder. Okay, so that's my base. And um, this is Sally Girl Eyeshadow in Rose. It's kind of a medium pink color. I didn't ask what colors, you know, if they were like a fuchsia color or a, like a cotton candy pink color. I'm not really sure. So I just kind of went with something in the middle, which is, you know, not the brightest, but not the softest either. And um, I'm going to use this as a peekaboo color. So this is going in my crease and above. And I'm going to take it about three-fourths of the way in. Go ahead and blend that out quite a bit. Don't, don't be afraid if it looks a little bit crazy right now. Because once, this is what it looks like. And so you can kind of see a little bit of the pink peeking through, but it's not too, too in your face. And pink is sometimes one of those colors that's a little bit harder to wear, because I know that if I wear it the wrong way, it makes me look like I've been doing this too much, like I've got allergies or something. Okay, so go ahead and do that. Now, you can skip this step if you want to, but what I did was I took, this is All May Intense Eye Color for Brown Eyes. Like that, and I'm going to take this bronze color here and a little pencil brush, and I'm going to keep that right in, in my actual crease. I'm not going to blend it anywhere, it's just going to be kind of soft. And you don't have to do this part, and you know, I'm going to take it all the way in. It's just to kind of add a little bit more depth to my crease. But I think it looks just as pretty if you just do the pink and gold. This look is really, really easy. It's really fast. I think it's really fresh for a summer wedding. So there's that. It's not that dark at all. Now I'm taking... That's gold mine right there. I need to do my nails. And I'm taking a little brush like this. And this is going to go all over my lid. Like that. Alright. And finally I'm taking a big fluffy brush. And this is Retrospec. It's right here. Bit any highlighter that you want and go ahead and do your brow bone I take it all the way in here and sweep it back up and blend out as much of that top line as you want so it's just kind of like a really diffused pink I feel like I need to sneeze Thank you. Okay, um, now I'm taking, I'm not sure if this is a daytime wedding or a nighttime wedding. Um, I'm, I'm just going to pretend like it's a daytime wedding. Even if it was a nighttime wedding, um, I'm going to use, this is Isadora Inliner Kajal in Indian Dark Brown. I got it at Walgreens. And I'm going to line my top lash line really, really close to my lash line. I'm not going to smoke it out at all. But if this was a nighttime wedding, you might want to. Okay. 
And um, I'm not going to take any, like, the gold onto the lower lash line. You can if you want to, but if you're like anything like me, you're going to be crying during the wedding because I'm a big crybaby. <laughs> so, um, I'm just going to do my waterline. Your window is open. I thought I closed it. do my waterline. One sec. Okay, and now I'm going to take um, my mascara. I'm going to do black mascara. And again, I'm only going to do the top. Okay, so now, like from the beginning when I first started and you first saw that like whoa, pink, you can see it's a little bit diffused. Now if it's too diffused for you, you can always go in with your fluffy brush and take a little dab and just go over it a little bit. Like that. So that way it's a little bit brighter and a little bit more noticeable. So that's the look, Summer 646. I hope you like it, and I hope you have tons of fun at your friend's wedding. Bye, guys. I just wanted to say one more quick thing before I get electrocuted. Um, I actually took this and used it as my blush. I know it doesn't really show up on camera that well, but it does look really, really pretty and, like, really fresh. So, um, you know... Maybe you guys should try and experiment with eyeshadows that you're wearing and, you know, putting them as blush. It kind of, like, ties everything together a little bit. Or maybe I'm crazy. I don't know. All right, it's storming, and I want to live. <laughs> so I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.